Hello children, welcome to Narana Live Classes. We have another set of assignment. You have unscramble and write the word based on the clues. Okay, now grasslands are found in every continent except Antarctica. Okay, you have some unscrambled words. You need to scramble and write. So where the grasslands are found in every continent except Antarctica. So do you find in Arctic? Even there also you don't find. Steps or steppes grasslands are found in with the help of this in Eurasia. Okay, steps, steppes you find in Eurasia. So some part of Russia also. Okay, gutters wear white brinnel hats called so you can see a uh, sobibors. Okay, sombers it's like a hat, a big hat, like a how the cowboys they wear cat hat. Dash grasslands have plenty of wildlife. So it's what? Temperate grasslands have plenty of wildlife. The native of Argentina are hunters. They are hunters. So that's why the uh, you have, most of the people, they depend on the livestock there. But it's not they hunt there. Okay, I mean, from ages, the grasses are so tall and you have so many wildlife there, wild animals. That's how they turn to be a hunters actually. Okay, is it clear? Now, mark the following statements as true or false and correct the statements that are false. Okay, grasslands are stretch of hilly lands. Okay, grasslands are stretch on, this is a false statement. The grasslands are stretch on the plain lands actually or temperate areas. That's a temperate area, right? temperate zone actually. So, grasslands are stretch on the plain land. Okay, the grasslands have only a few trees. That is true. You don't have more trees in grassland, you have more grass in grassland. The statement is true. But what, which is the wrong statement, you need to write the right answer below that. Tall grasses grown in the areas with more rainfall and the short grasses grown in the dry area. That is also true statement. Okay, the answer is true here. Okay, emus carry their young one in the pouch. Emus don't carry, the kangaroos carry the young one in the pouch. They, they actually grow, okay. So, kangaroo, so where you find kangaroo? Kangaroo is a sobibo, it's a kangaroo land you can call as a, um, Australia, right? So, the statement is false. So, where you find? In kangaroo. You find the kangaroo carries the angle in the pouch and in the downs. Where is down? In Australia. Frost and snowfall are common in the grasslands of the northern hemisphere. Grasslands are asking. So, the statement is false. So, what long grasses are found in the grasslands? Long grasses. Is it clear for you? Coming to the uh, fill in the blank. The temperate grassland lies between dash and dash north and the south equator. What they are asking? The temperate grassland lies between 40 degrees and 55 degrees. These are the latitudes, you know, these are the tropics. Okay, the temperate grasslands lies between 40 degrees and 55 degrees north and south of equator, north to the south of equator. Those are the grasslands area, temperate zones. Is it clear? 65% of Argentina's population lives in the Pampas area. So, Pampas where you have more and more of uh, uh, the cultivation and the uh, uh, farming and rearing and livestock, everything. So, 50, 65% of Argentina lives in the Pampas area. The most important winds in Argentina are cool and they are called as Pampro. They are called as Pampro. Okay, Mount Antigio is the highest peak in the Andes. And where is Andes? Andes is in South America. Temperate grasslands are found mainly outside the tropic or temperate zone. Okay. Temperate grasslands are found mainly outside the tropic of temperate zone. Is it clear, children? I mean, now I can answer the textual exercises. One, you're thorough with your lesson. This lesson is all about the grasslands, right? You have the tall grasslands where... You don't find most of the, uh, what you can say, um, the vegetation. Only few where you have the um, uh, prairies, where the wheat cultivation is more. Okay, and in the South America also you have more of wheat cultivation. But the long, you don't find more of the tall trees there. You have the tall grasses there. Okay, now coming to this, in the blanks, the steppes are the temperate grasslands of Eurasia. 
okay, when you talk about Eurasia, you have some part of Europe also in that. The steppes are the temperate grassland of Eurasia. The pampro are the cool winds that blows over the pampas. Okay, like hot winds, you have the cold winds also. The pampro are the cold winds that blows in the pampas. The ancestors of the most Argentinians of today have the common form of Spain and Italy. Okay, see the ancestors of most Argentinians of today's have come from Spain and Italy. You know, if you can see the Argentinians, they have the different languages they speak. Uh, Spain, Spanish and French and Italian language. So the ancestors of Argentina are come from the Spain and Italy. Gochos, these are like cowboys. They are the, the uh, native of the South America. Okay, are the residents of the South American Pampas. Farming and rearing are the major occupation of the living of the Pampas. Means Pampas is a, a grassland, right? So farming and the rearing of animals is a main occupation of pampas. So pampas in South America, right? Let's go for the next one. Take the correct answer and write in the blanks. The pampas, the typical grasslands of Argentina lies in the continent of South America. Okay, it, where it lies? It lies in the South America. Prairies in the North America. The mountain ranges of dash border and the border the western side of the Argentina. What is the question? The mountain ranges of dash border the western sides of Argentina. This is what the dash mountain ranges, Andes, you find Andes in the South America, right? So Himalayas, Rockies and Andes. Rockies you find in the North America. Himalaya definitely in India, Andes mountain, okay? Dash farming is done using machines, intensive, extensive or plantation. It is extensive farming used with the help of machine. The capital city of Argentina is, what is the capital city of Argentina? You have Santiago, it is Corbo, or it is Buenos Aires. The capital city of Argentina is Buenos Aires. Okay, now go for the next one. Match the following. You have the different grasslands here. Downs is Australia. Wales you find in South Africa. Okay, whales you find in South Africa, prairies you find in North America, steppes or steppes you find in Eurasia, pampas you find in South America. Is it clear? These are different grasslands. Coming to the next slide. See, this is your recapitulation of the lesson with the help of the mind map, the grasslands, North America, prairies. South America, Pampas, Russia, Steppes, that's the reason it's called Eurasia. Some part of the Russia you find in Europe also, right, near the Poland. South Africa, Wales, Australia, Downs, Central Africa, Savannas. So in Africa, you have Wales as well as Savanna. Okay, this is the different grasslands which are available in the world. Next is your new words. Okay. And we have given the two columns. You have 10 new words for just uh, uh, recapture purpose. We have just given your prairies, pampa, steps, and paragu or sobios. These are the new words which you need to understand and which grasslands are available in which continent. Okay. Understand the spelling, read the spelling thoroughly, and make use of this assignment thoroughly, children, and make use of your textbook and make a habit of reading your textbook, children. Thank you.